The low country will be without one of its major Halloween attractions this year. Boone Hall announced it will not have the famous Fright Nights this year. News 2's Travis Rice has why and people's reaction. No Fright Nights this year. Oh, no way. Why? Word of no Fright Nights spread fast all the way to the United Kingdom. Oh, that's bad. I've been two years in a row and it's fantastic. I love it. Have you ever been? Back home, people who know what a grand event it is say something doesn't smell right. Well, I don't know that it could have gotten any better, but I'm, I'm really shocked that it's not going to be there this year, and that's really crappy. In a statement, Boone Hall says they and the production company that usually helps put it on parted ways earlier this year, and they ran out of time to find a replacement player. What do you think about that? It's interesting. It's always been a popular event. Uh, you see just lines of cars down 17 waiting to get in. I don't know why they shut down the only one in the uh, in the area. A spokesman for Boone Hall tells me they are disappointed that they can't have Fright Nights for 2016, but he assures me next year the event is back on and it will be bigger, better, and of course scarier. In Mount Pleasant, Travis Rice, News 2. Travis, thank you. Boone Hall officials say they will still have the pumpkin patch, kid-friendly hay rides, and also a corn maze this year, and that opens up October 1st.